Hello everyone and welcome, I am Duke James, this is my EU4 Mule Texas Serbia campaign fighting Aragon. I'm going to make a peace deal with them. It's gonna be this, it's not much. Messina and Galera gives me a base in Corsica, or Sardinia, whatever, whichever one that one is, and uh, Sicily. Plus 431 ducats, it limits the aggressive expansion because I think my... I want to expand more into the Adriatic. That's where I feel like my aggressive expansion should go towards. And this is kind of an afterthought, for now at least. Because I think every single province I take... I get aggressive expansion with Naples. And plus this is a little bit too far away. So this is good, I can start getting bases over here that'll help with... Actually, I don't want... Yeah, because I don't want any of this territory anyway. Basically, it's just these islands. And this area. Okay. So, yeah. It's good enough for now. Grab those guys. Galich? No. Heilek Vona? No. Milan? Has. No. If Milan didn't have an heir, then okay, but they do. Who doesn't have heirs? Austria? So nobody. No, guys, I don't want... I'm not gonna marry any any of you. <clears throat> Lesser nobles gain power in Messina. Okay. Aragon went bankrupt. Look at this border goer over here. This is horrible. Look at this. Aquitaine, England, Castile has an enclave or an exclave or whatever. Aragon's reaching up into France for some reason. I thought, even though they're allies. Austria? What does Austria want? You want territory back? Is that what you want? Where's the Holy Roman Empire map mode? Let's see this. I have no idea where this map mode is. Imperial. It's actually on my bar, I don't know why. So... Looks like that province and Garizia is the only two provinces in Nice, I suppose, that I'm gonna have problems with. Possibly these two, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna conquer those provinces. 
Well, gotta decline them. So there's no way I'm returning that. What was that? Let's see, this truce ends, I think, 64, and the Mamluk truce ends 63. Looks like uh, Tripoli became free. And the Damascus rebels failed. That is a lot of rebels. Let's do this expedition again. So I think for now I'm going to wait for the Retina Truce to end. Because I don't really have a play on anything else. I'm going to hold off expanding into Italy for now. I suppose I could conquer Wallachia. I cancel the transfer trade power. Oh, you know, I think I wanted to, but I don't have a claim. I have to build a spy network. Deal with them. Let's grab that guy because he's half price. Have these trade ships do something.
I gotta watch out for these rebellions, because there's a ton of them. Should be able to get claims or cores going on these provinces. That's just Galuria. Which is, that's not going to come down. I'm going to have to fight a rebellion over there. I can't core these because of the coring distance. Alright. Yeah, I don't have a claim, so I'm going to build a spy network. And then I'll fight them if I get that spy network before I have to fight, before I can fight a retina. Bohemia declared war upon Naples. Oh, it's a coalition war. That is... Excellent. Bohemia, Bayern, Munich, Otengen, Nuremberg, Passau, Aux Augsburg, Verona, Rothenburg, Trent, Regensburg, blah, 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 blah. Brandenburg, Prussia, Livonian Order. It's a lot of little guys. Florence is even in there. So it's what? Florence, Bohemia, Prussia's probably pretty big. They ate their vassals. I don't know if Prussia can get over there. Austria's in there too. This is basically death by a thousand cuts. It's a lot of little guys. I wonder if I could give Kandatiari to somebody. Ah, because I have a truce. Until six years, so I can't help them at all. I guess I could attack Rome. And that would call Naples in, but... Uh... Eh, I don't think that's worth it. Let's see, I think I want linen. No, I want cloth. Al Jalil. Okay, so I'm going to get those cores, and then fight all these rebels, and then fight a retina. Retina should be a couple more wars, because they're at 171. And then they'll be gone. Ulm, sure, I'll give you access. I'll give everybody access. You guys want to come over here and beat up Sicily? It's fine by me. Even, oh no, okay, Venice was allied to Naples, so they're going to get wrecked.
20 to 25,000 men already. I'm sure Vic so. Hey, the Iberian wedding happened. That's not good for me. It's a lot of regiments, but they have no leader. It's dry lands? Alright, so this should be... Should be an easy fight, for the most part. There we go. There are some good rolls. All right. Yeah, they've already taken a brute, so. Naples is screwed. That's actually the first time I've seen a coalition war in a long time. Usually it doesn't happen with the AI. Let's drop these guys off in Leche. Speaking of this province, now it's 22 pop. Got a bunch of cores. I can start coring Ka Constantinople. No. Uh, Cairo. That's what I was going for. Cairo and the province next to them. My overextension drops to 145. I should be making a lot of money now. Eight ducats. I wouldn't call that a lot of money, but it's a lot more than I was making. Send a guy to convert that province. Castile wants... Okay, so Castile inherited that war with Air, with England. England, Scotland, and Aquitaine, and they're losing it. Castillo is actually not allied with anybody. Also, they're Tech 22. Let's go ahead and drill. Don't drill. No drill. It's 19 force limit there, so I'm going to move them to Messina. Looks like Naples won over here. Not sure how they can move through this fort that they don't occupy. It's the AI with their kooky fort mechanics. Hungary is, uh, yeah, they're getting occupied quickly. I think they only have one one or two forts, actually. Maybe three. But I think two forts are over here to protect against me, which is pretty smart. But they left this area pretty much wide open. Actually, there's a fort right here. That was taken quickly, though. So there are troops over here still. They're just on this province for some reason, and not this province. Alright, took them out. I can core this province now. 
pick up those guys. Take manpower from the lesser nobles. Unfortunately, none of them have a navy. So they're not going to be able to invade Venice. The other problem is I made Milan Orthodox, so I can't do a Deus Vault CB against them, which is why I don't, I'm not doing that on anybody else. I think for the most part, I only have aggressive expansion problems with Venice and Naples. And that's actually going down pretty quickly, so I think... Actually, I'll, I'll kill Oretna, or at least neuter them. They shouldn't have many provinces left after a war. And then, uh, then I'll go back and probably attack... Probably Verona, because I want to conquer the Adriatic. So I'll probably take Veronese territories. Ah, and Garizia is in a... They're in a... Trade League. So they got all these little guys. They're not much of a problem, though. So I think I'll try to conquer these two guys after I fight a retina. Or the Mamluks? Maybe I'll go to the Mamluks first. They actually end August 1563. Alright, so that will be in the next part. I'm going to end this part here and pick it up there. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.